Today I'm going to be reviewing this Yuki Super Power Turbo Fan. It's supposed to be like an air duster. And this was recently sent to me by the brand. So I'm going to go and open this up, show you everything you get inside. And then, of course, I'll test it out on some dust and dirt. Try it maybe here inside the house. I might try it on some vehicles as well. See how well that works, like dust off the dashboard, something like that. So we've got the user manual. You can see this is going to be relatively small. I'm not sure if it's going to be on or not let's see yep so you're just going to hold that down wow that does have a lot of movement you can see how much it's moving that so that's that's going to be a really high power fan that is a massive surprise to me just because of i was thinking this is going to be like not that powerful at all just looking at its size so you're going to turn on the back it is going to be rechargeable that's going to be a super nice feature and then to push this it's just like got, got a little spot right here you're just going to push that button and you can see it's easily blowing all of this stuff away now this is going to be a cardboard box so i don't think it's going to move that and it will that is insane how how much airflow this thing is going to do so let me go ahead and go outside and actually try this on like the floorboards of my car i've got dust and dirt that sort of thing let me try it on that as well but this is absolutely insane to me how much how powerful this is I actually found a really good spot inside here. So we've got this back rug back here that we need to vacuum off. My kids tracked some mud in today. And so I just want to kind of show you how this is going to work on this, just how powerful this fan is. So watch this. Look at all of that dirt that is actively moving off of this rug. This is a really, really powerful fan. Now you could use this for like dusting, maybe if you're dusting like off a computer or something like that. You could also use this, you know, if you're trying to get dust off of something, maybe off of shelving or something like that without having to actually take it off. This is gonna be really, really powerful. I cannot, I cannot state, overstate how surprised I am by how powerful this little air duster is. So here's another example of how you could use this. So I actually have a robot vacuum. And so this is gonna be the little bin for it. And what always happens on these is your things are gonna get, your little filters are gonna get dusty, right? So normally to clean these out, I'll have to go and get the big air compressor or something like that to get this dust out of here. And I just wanna show you, okay, you can kind of see how dirty it is now. Let's go ahead and clean it with this. Just look at all of that dust that's coming out of this. Being 100% honest, I would totally use this to clean out the filters on this vacuum rather than having to drag out my air compressor. Like, I am so surprised how powerful this little thing is. I was expecting it to be just a little bit, but this has so much power. You could easily use it for clean out filters like this. You could use it for clean out filters on regular vacuums. You know, if you're dusting off shelves, dusting out your car, whatever the case might be, this thing is going to be powerful enough to handle. Absolutely a fantastic product. I cannot say that enough. One last thing I don't want to showcase was this is actually going to have an automatic mode as well. So after you turn it on, it's going to have low, medium, and high, essentially. It, I was showing showcasing it on high, but you can do a little bit lower than that if you want. So you can just push these little things here. And then when you push on the trigger, it's now going to be on that soft mode. So then you push it again. That's going to be on hard. And then you're just going to go back. So if I want to go on three, then I can do that. If I want to do two, then I can do that. That's going to be like a medium. And then that's going to stay on automatically without you holding down the trigger. And the same thing on this one, so I can go up to, up to three, and then I can do it like that. I don't know if three is going to stay on automatically or not. It doesn't look like it. Looks like two will and one will, but the third one is not going to stay on automatically, which is fine. Um, just overall, I cannot believe how powerful this thing is.